everyone, please welcome Joel Farrow joining us this morning on Skype, on the Skype. Hello, Joel. <laughs> Hi, how are you? I'm doing fantastic. It's great to have you here. Great Somewhat here. here, virtually here, you know. No, this is like the, like, 2021 here, you know. Some of the cheerleaders are cam girls. Maybe you didn't know everything about your sister. Amelia had such incredible potential. Her death left a real void here. She made a mistake becoming a cam girl. Webcam cheerleaders premiere Sunday at 8. Okay, so basically, you know, um, Maisie, I play both Maisie and Amelia, um, but they are identical twin sisters. And once, you know, Amelia passes away um, and it is a suicide, she comes back to spend mm. some time with her family and just be closer to them. Um, and she wants to join the cheer team because that's where Amelia was so happy. And she thinks, you know, I can, I can almost like live my sister's legacy through this team and get to know the people that loved her so much. Um, and you kind of find out throughout the movie, you're gonna have to watch it to see, but uh, you do mm. find out throughout the movie that, you know, she, she isn't, completely convinced that it is a suicide and she teams up with some people and she's trying to see who she can trust and and basically go on this journey of finding out what truly really did happen to her sister now some of the cheer squad are up to mischievous things as macy finds them on a webcam site discuss with our audience how this situation will progress in the movie yeah absolutely so i mean she she finds out through somebody who she actually does trust and when mm -hmm. she finds out that you know there is there is a site and there is something that you know cheerleaders are doing that she doesn't necessarily think is safe um yeah. she puts her investigator cap on and she decides <laughs> it's time to really you know she's a truth seeker she's like i am yeah. ready to go uh, do whatever I need to do to make sure that whatever, you know, she thinks may have potentially happened to her sister or other people throughout mm -hmm. the film doesn't happen anymore. So you really see her go from this kind of timid character who's nervous coming into a new school and you see her just grow into this strong, confident um, girl who really fights for what she believes in. Even in the movie, the athletic director, he's in on this dirty little secret as he helps run the webcam website. What? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Now, Joelle, what is something you learned from taking on this role? As we all know, these webcam sessions are real things that happen on the internet and sometimes can turn yeah. into, you know, really seriously deadly games. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you have to be so careful, especially with being online. This is something that while we were filming the movie, it was apparent mm -hmm. to a lot of the cast that this does happen and it happens often where you know you trust certain people online or something seems like it could be a quick fix to maybe some of your problems in life not actually seeing beyond what is immediately in front of you which is the dangers that could happen um yeah. you know after that and it is something that i think the movie the movie really does touch on a lot it shows how dangerous it really can be and hopefully it just points those people who haven't really thought through everything that they're doing online helps them realize this this could put me in danger, it could put people in my life in danger, um, and it has definitely lasting effects. I think something that sets this film apart is, you know, it really allows the audience to see this very real trauma happening in this family, um, mm -hmm. facing the loss of a twin and the loss of a daughter. And, you know, it is a suspense-filled movie, but it definitely doesn't shy away from some of the ways that people might some of the great lengths they might go to deal with this type of emotional pain. Um, and I think a lot of the times in real life or in movies, you kind of see what happens directly after um, a tragedy yeah. or a death. But in this, you know, it's kind of following, you know, the year the year following is sometimes the hardest. And I think it really does uncover layers and layers of how different people process their emotions. And it's evident that both Maisie and her family all process those emotions very differently. So mm -hmm. um, I think it's, it's something that people can take away and learn and know when to get help um, and mm -hmm. know when to reach out to people when you're struggling and being able to recognize that in yourself. Very well said. Joelle Farrow, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us here at iHollywood TV. Everyone, be sure to tune in and catch Webcam Cheerleaders premiering September the 5th at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, only on Lifetime for their Fear the Cheer Slate movies. Uh, Joelle, take care and have a great rest of your day. You as well. Thanks so much. Bye. Thank you. Bye.